Hey everyone, welcome to another one in Phasmophobia. Let's hop into Point Hope. We got a 3.66 times multiplier right, this here. time. Take a look at the equipment because we need accordingly before starting the investigation. Spirit box response. Let's see, where's New the waker? Reports of light switching. Let me open this Possibly if the game allows me to. Thank you. <laughs> Oh my god, the highest point possible. So they have changed the breaker spawns here. It, that's the highest point it can be. Oh, and we got the nice sunrise weather. Let me get out of there. Let me get out. Let me get out. Give me this. Oh, we have to walk in the dark for so long here. Phew. Oh, it's so beautiful. Look at this. So if the ghost, ding dong, if the ghost keeps killing the breaker, we're gonna have a hard time because we don't have headgears or something like that. But we'll somehow manage it. So let's hop in. This looks so beautiful. Let's go. Not into the wall, but into this here. <laughs> okay, we got this hiding spot. Whoa! Tossing some pictures at me here, huh? Did you touch that door? Let me see. No, of course not. Whoa! What's going on here? Delete this. I mean, give me the crucifix. Where is it? I can't... Ah, there. It's here. Ghosty is here. Where's um, the thermal? Let me step in. Look. Okay, I mean I can leave. I got two smudges now. I don't know what has been thrown. Let me uh, keep the flashlight for now. And let me check for the bone. So we're gonna turn the brake on. Oh, sorry, why is my nose so empty now? We got hiding up here. We also got hiding downstairs in that one room. Hey, it's good that the ghost is down there, but uh, the downside is that the breaker is pretty far away. I don't want to miss all the action, but I have to turn the brake on and look for the bone, you know. I have to go all the way back up anyways, so... Where's that bone? Where's that bone? Give it to me. Give it to me, please. Give me bony pants. Okay, here we got the bathroom. And one floor above, we're gonna see our breaky pants. That sounds a bit weird, breaky pants. Breaky pants? <laughs> Electric hat, breaker pants. <laughs> Electric bob, breaker pants. <laughs> okay. So let's see, where is that? Friends. Hello, friends. Uh -huh. <laughs> Okay, no bony pants here. Maybe it's all the way upstairs. But if we find it here now, then uh, we don't have to come up here anymore. Okay, this is the maintenance room. We don't see anything here. This one is not available. We have to be careful with the light though. Oh, there you are, buddy. Found, yeah. Okay, photos are looking good so far. And turn those off, we don't need those. We don't have to come back here ever again, at least in this round. Ah, turn it off. Okay, these are off, let's go. Let's keep all the lights off. Let's keep the breaker on. Let's hope Ghosty won't turn it off. Check, yeah, it's still fine. Because some lights would be nice, so we have some time down there. Okay, let's get moving. Run, 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 run. Please, Ghosty, don't be like a Hantu. I mean, even if you are a Hantu, you could be going easy on the breaker. Ghosty, I'm back. Ghosty. I don't know which door that was. This one. No, I don't want to whisk it. I, I don't want to whisk it. I don't want to whisk the biscuit. I don't want to whisk the biscuit. Let me move this a bit. Okay, uh, let me see. I could have placed that a while ago. Let's check 
four thingies around here. You've closed that one, huh? There's no hiding here. No thingies, okay. Let me see. It's not that cold here. Are you in here? Oh, damn it. Oh, I thought it killed the waker. It didn't. Okay. Are you in here? No, you seem to be in here, but why is the temperature not low enough? Weird. Whatever. see an orb here. Where's the spirit box? Let me check this. Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you a child? Are you old? What do you want? Why are you here? Show yourself. Are you here? Are you close? Are you a child? Yes. 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 You are a spirit box ghosty pants. Yay. That makes me so happy. I needed that. Yay! Okay, turn on those. We need to keep an eye on our sanity. Let's leave that here. Grab this. It could be a stalky ghost. It can be a wraith though. Door. But which one? This one? Okay, good. Again. No thingies yet. You love that door, don't you? Yes, it worked. Do we need a ghost photo? No, we don't. Okay, that's good. No way then. Oh. Oh, dirty water. Give me, give me dirty water. One. Two. Two. It worked. Yes. It's nice. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, where are my dotsies? Place some here and place some here. Temps are pretty high though. Are you in here? Oh, this seems to be your room, huh? Okay. So let me put those in here and we can place the camera in front of it. It might have interacted through the wall here. Yeah? That was only one step, mister. Why are you not so generous here, huh? Let me quickly check my sanity. It could be a Moroi, and if it's a Moroi, I would have been cast by now. Because I got a spirit box response, and... Ooh, that's pretty low. Okay. 73, 71. Let's keep that in mind. We could get a perfect game. 73, 71. We still need to look for for orbies, we need to look for EMF 5, we need to test the book, maybe for UV, the dear Yoe, no, Yoe is off the table, damn it, Onryo is still possible though, ah, Onryo, damn, and there goes the breaker, well done ghosty, well done, mm, of course, it's gonna be annoying to go all the way back up now. What door was it? I'm gonna whisk it, yes. Do I have candles here? Yes, here we go. One. Two. And three. Let's place them like this, this should cover everything. Um, give me a smudge. I'm gonna toss one into this. I'm gonna hold on to this one and I'm gonna put this over here with the smudge and the crucifix. I wanna see it. Oh, let me leave that here as well. A second, I can 
Did you just use the crucifix? Are you an on wheel? Oh yes, you are. Okay, I think it's an on wheel. Let me see, let me see. This crucifix has been used up. I gotta be careful. It needs to be an on wheel. My sanity can't be that low. Or a more, let's see. We have lost a lot of sanity there. What was it, 73 something? But it's still above 60, which means it has to be an early hunting ghost, which means it can't be this, it can't be this. Not this, not this. It, I wasn't talking yet. It can just be this because a male can hunt at 60 if the lights are off, but it's above 60, so that's it. Do we have an orb? What else does an unreal have? Freezing, we could. Freezing and orbs, was it, right? It was orb freezing? Yeah. Can check for freezing. I don't know if there's an orb in there. Oh, I got only one more camera. It's okay, it's okay. If we don't get the freezing, then it's... Uh, and it was three candles. They have been blown out. That's why the ghost tried to hunt me. It's gonna be dark now. Where are the candles? Let's make a freezing here. Where the heck do you think you're going, huh? Turn that off because it's gonna distract me a bit. Oh, it's gonna be hunting from there, huh? We have to repel this ghost as well. Oh yes, you are here now, huh? It can't change ghost room, by the way. I have to be so careful. I have to be so careful. We have to cleanse. We have. We need a ghost event, and we have to repel while it's chasing someone. So we're gonna wait for it to blow out the candles. We're gonna sit on the crucifix. We got two seconds grace period, so it should be fine. We could get a perfect game here if we can get the ghost event. We can tease it a bit with the candles, maybe. Oh, the EMF had a weird shadow there. I hope the ghost's gonna turn the breaker back on, maybe, eventually. I'm gonna turn this on, because if it turns the breaker back on, we'll see the lights turning on. It's a small chance, but it's possible for the ghost to turn the breaker back on. I think I'm gonna grab an additional candle for here. Still burning. One! Still burning in there. They're burning. Which means the ghost can't hunt as long as it's, it's near them. They have a 4 meter range for the unreal. So I'm gonna go in with this one. Ah, see? What did I just say? Ghosty hurt me. Thank you, buddy. <coughs> we got the lights out here, so it turned the lights back on, which is kinda cute. Cute, ghosty. Cutie. So we can turn those on. We can leave the candle here. Oh, those are a bit glitchy, huh? Put those here. The lights are a bit glitchy down here because if there are too many, it's hunting. That's perfect timing, Granny! I really appreciate you. Get over here. So for the ghost event, I suggest we're just gonna be sitting there and waiting for it to start a hunt. Let's turn that off for now because, by the way, thank you for turning the lights back on. I really appreciate that. Let's tease Gwenny a little bit, a little bit. She's gonna be afraid that uh, the house gonna be burnt down. Uh oh, I'm running out of matches. I need to grab new ones. Good thing I checked that. Because 
it might be dangerous. Okay, let me get out. Grab my second package because if you ignite those candles you use up the matches. You need to keep track on those. We got ten in each uh, package, I think. As you can see, we got a full package now. Okay, let's chill in there. Let's just sit in the hiding spot and wait for a ghost event to happen. It could take up to 45 minutes or something. Bing bong, wake up, Granny. Okay, there's the candles lit. Okay, let's go in here. We can use the candle as a crucifix. So we're just gonna be sitting in here. And she's gonna do a ghost event eventually. Don't need a ghost photo. And I could still delete one photo, but since those are all tier 3, I can't do it. But it's obviously an unreal, so... But it's not 100% guaranteed that the ghost, that the unreal tries to hunt after blowing out three candles. Sometimes they don't in the beginning, so you can rely also... also rely on the hunting threshold if it tries to hunt at 60% sanity without any candles being involved that's also an the unreal can hunt at 60% I'm a bit careful in the hiding spot with talking even if I don't press V they used to hear me after the update and I don't trust the devs that they have fixed that they that in the patch note they have fixed that but like I said I don't trust it what did you do to my expensive equipment hello no respect to other people's property huh damn those ghosts nowadays okay so I'll be chilling here in the closet if my sanity hits zero, the chances for a ghost event increase. I'll be back when the ghost event happens. It was an air ball. Let's get out of here. I just wanted to um, reignite the candles there. And then uh, the lights turned off and there was an air ball. Great, that was our ghost event we needed. And we were at 30% sanity. Great, so this seems to be an unreal with, uh, I would say, 70% possibility. What was that? That sounded like a UA door touch. But it can't be a UA, because the UA is already out. Yeah, it can only be an Unreal, I guess. According to the behavior. And I don't see an orb in there, so... And a turn on the water again. Okay, Granny, you wash your hands, because you've been touching those dirty candles. It's okay. I'll be gone. You got your electricity bag, you fixed it, so you should be fine in there. Welcome back. And there we go, I'll and Unreal. And we got the spirit box. What a lucky day. And my monitor jump scares me again. I hate it so much. Okay. So yeah, we have done the dailies. I think that was all of them. And we are processing with the weeklies. So the next one think I'm gonna try to make some money and do something difficult but lately it has been going terribly wrong but I'm gonna try it with uh, lantern room bottom okay so it used the abilities three times and it hunted three times because it blew out three candles and then started a hunt every time so that's how and it hunted early I think that also counts so yeah that was the unreal so if you want to test for Unreal at the beginning at high sanity, you can use three candles, not four, use three because the fourth one would cancel the ability. Wait for it to blow them out or place them, do something else. And if all of a sudden you see a hunt is being triggered or the crucifix has been burned, then you know, okay, it has to be an Unreal. You can check your sanity if it's pretty high, like above 70% or something like that. You can uh, say with a high chance that it's a non-real. And if the candles have been blown out, of course, when uh, the hunt started. Where the g it depends on where the ghost wants. Because for an non-real, the candles are like the tier 2 crucifix, which means within 
4 meter range, wait, let me check this real quick, let me check this, um, 4 meter range, it can't start a hunt. Yeah, it has 4 meter range, you see number 4 here, down there. The tier 1 has 3 meter. You have to be careful if you use tier 3, because this is, has 5 meters, but uh, the range for the candle and the unreal is always the same, it's always 4 meters. So uh, it might be able to use the crucifix if it's not in range of the candle, but in range of the crucifix. So on Rio with tier 3 crucifix is a bit tricky, but um, yeah, it's, I would say it's not 100% chance uh, for the Unreal to start a hunt at the first time when it blew out three candles. Sometimes they don't. So you can also double check that later on once your sanity is low enough with the candles again and if the ghost just doesn't use the crucifix underneath a lit candle then it could be likely to be a non-wheel and if your sanity drains further and further and if you have keep the candles lit the whole time and the ghost just doesn't hunt remember to keep motion to use motion sensors to know if the ghost is nearby then uh, you can say with a high chance that you might be dealing with an non-wheel zero evidence <laughs> so i hope you liked it i hope this helps you with your next and we on rio encounter see you in the next one bye